Today I'm doing an Aldi haul, pre-Thanksgiving Aldi haul. I've got a lot of the things that I need already. I'm going to be spending the time at my daughter's, but I haven't been on for a while. I've got several videos to upload, so I'll be uploading those soon. But I wanted to come to you and show you some of the things that I bought for our Thanksgiving meal. Some Just some things I bought. Um, I'm going to do a charcuterie and the perfect place to get your Aldi charcuterie items is Aldi. They have so many varieties and it was so hard to pick. And I didn't want to do too much because there's only going to be a, um, a small party. So I don't want to get too many things, but I'm just going to get right into it. I'm going to show you some of the items I got for the charcuterie, which was these roasted almonds with sea salt. Great deal. $4.45. That's a great deal because that's almost a pound of almonds. I've got the queso blanco. That's not for the charcuterie, but that's for uh, a snack. And you know, I haven't seen that there before. That's why I got that. That was a dollar ninety-five. That's a really good deal. And then back to the charcuterie items. This six cracker assortment. Y'all, look at this. Six cracker assortment, $2.89. That is amazing. There's no artificial flavors, no garbage in there. And it has six assortments, sesame wheat, multi-grain entertainer, rosemary, poppy pepper, and five grain. I love that, $2.89. I picked that up. I was like, wow, that is a great deal. Next thing I got was the California Mission Mi Figs. <laughs> California Mission Migs. California Mission Figs. They were $1.89. And originally I had picked up the dried cherries, but I thought these would be more healthy. They were a dollar cheaper and figs are really delicious with cheese. So that, that pairs really well with cheese. And I'm doing this on my back counter because I have so much stuff going on. I'm cooking a bunch of stuff today. So the little Spanish manzanella olives, 79 cents. Who doesn't love these? I can eat a whole jar of these by myself. Um, got the dried Mediterranean apricots. Those were $2.65. That is also going to be a good addition to the figs with our cheese tray. Got the spicy Italian dry salami. That is really good, y'all. And that is a pound, a pound of spicy salami. That was $6. But I've had that before, and that is really good, and it's perfect for a charcuterie board. Next thing I got was these specialty selected jalapeno stuffed olives. I do have some blue cheese stuffed olives that I'm going to use as well. And I believe those were $2.99. Y'all, that is a great deal because that goes a long way. So next thing on our charcuterie is I'm going to use these. Where'd those little cookies go? Oh, the dark chocolate gingerbread hearts. They are filled with an apricot fruit filling and coated in dark chocolate. They're made in Germany. And I think these are going to be delicious to just add to the charcuterie board. They were $1.99, y'all. $1.99. So all the items that I've gotten, I don't have all the cheese here because I bought that earlier. Probably about 20 bucks for my charcuterie, and that's a really good deal. The most expensive thing is going to be this dry salami. Um, also, I got some sharp cheddar cheese. These blocks are $1.69. Can't go wrong with those. Uh, cream cheese, 79 cents. I have a couple different recipes I'm using this for. The almond speculus, speculatious. I don't know how you pronounce that, but somebody tell me. I've had these in the past. They are delicious. Made in Germany. These were actually $2.99. Uh, wait a minute. Are they $2.99? Nope. $1.99. $1.99. And those will go a long way as well. Um, some of the things that I got today that weren't specifically for the charcuterie board was these sweet potatoes. Y'all, I could not believe this. This bag of sweet potatoes was $0.45. Cents. 45 cents, y'all, and I eat these. I should have got more, but I got two bags because I don't want them to go bad. But 45 cents, y'all, for two huge bags of sweet potatoes. Got the celery for my stuffing, 99 cents. Got two of those. Got sweet relish just for our pantry because we do run out of that from time to time. And I believe that relish, $1.25, that's a really good deal, y'all. The celery was 99 cents. Marshmallows for your sweet potatoes, 85 cents. You will not find those cheaper anywhere else in town, at least in my town. 
bought Rolos to make the little pe pretzel turtles. Those were $2.99. That's probably one of the most expensive items. They're just, they never go on sale at Aldi. The almond bark, cheaper at Aldi than it is at other stores, and it's $2.69, which is a great deal. Of course, my milk, which I talk, to, talk about quite a bit, is the organic. Because the organic, organic DHA Omega-3. I always buy that with the DHA Omega-3 because there's no hormones in this milk. It's $2.99. It's a little more expensive than the other one. The other one's $2.69. But I buy this when they have it. They don't always have it because it's better for me being a cancer survivor. Pineapples, 75 cents for a fresh pineapple. Very good deal. And then last but not least is the Boulder napkins, $1.45. They are still limiting the napkins two per person. So um, I only got one. I'll leave some for everybody else. We can go back and get some later. Um, with the Aldi spikes, we, or the COVID spikes, we are um, trying to minimize our time in the stores. We are going to spend Thanksgiving with family, but it's going to be a very small gathering, probably about 10 people. So we are going to be good. So I hope you all enjoyed this with some of the charcuterie items that I showed you today that we bought for my charcuterie board. I'm excited about that. And you all have a wonderful and happy Thanksgiving. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. And if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, why not? Hit that subscribe button. And we have probably about six videos to upload here real soon. So thanks so much for watching Mom's Cherished Home. Bye.